All right. Here is, I think, is something amazing. We'll see how impressed you are. Now, forgive the different colors here. I've got several different uh, trucks. I mixed the top right uh, bed with uh, Huna uh, cab. Doesn't matter. But here we have a uh, stock Huna 1573 truck. However, I have, let's see if I can do this without driving it off the end of the table. You can see the proportional steering. I set this up with ESCs and altered the dump box so it goes up to almost a 90 degree angle. Okay. So here's our normal truck. That's not the amazing part. If you give me five minutes and we'll time it. Okay. I want to show you something really cool. All right. I'll walk you through my steps. First thing, the bed comes off. We are going to put on a different bed. All right. Let's get a hold of it. Okay. Couple snips. All right. Shorter bed. We don't need that anymore. This is going to be the new bed. This great big giant thing. Wait a second. How's that going to fit? Well, here's how. We're going to put the new bed on here. Well, how's that going to work? Well, let's extend this. Let's make this truck bigger. Let's make it dual front wheel turning. Let's see if we can do that. All right. Let's make some room. Get rid of that. Put that over there. Okay. Step one. I'm going to go through my side piece here. Never discount zip ties. Never discount zip ties. These things. I did this at first just to see where I was going to put the permanent uh, binders to this. And I clipped it up and I ran it and, and it held firm even with a load. All right. Let's get my reading glasses on my eyes instead of on my head. Might help a little more right through there. All right. I'm telling you it's going to be worth the wait. You guys are going to be impressed. All right. Let's get our guy hooked up here. Tightened up. Tightened up. All right. Now we got to hook into our drive system. Now what I did was I ended up using regular server servos. I tried using the um, converted the stock ESC ones or stock uh, Huna ones over to ESCs and for some bizarre reason, and I don't know what was going on, they, they wouldn't mesh. The tires weren't steering together, so I ended up doing the servos. And it, it seems to be working out great. All right, let's get the bottom hooked up here. All right. Let's move the wheels so we can stop the chirping. Incidentally, I got... One of these Fly Sky units that's the four channel one, and I love it, but it doesn't chirp at you. It's fantastic. The cre this thing, every time, you know, if you, if you let it set for, you know, four minutes or something without operating something on the vehicle, it starts chirping at you or blah, blah. Oh, man. That thing doesn't chirp at all. I love it. Okay. 
And of course, because I'm in a hurry, I put the zip tie on backwards. Come on, you little rascal. Flip. Did you flip? Of course you didn't, you little... Hey, yeah, 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 we don't swear, we don't get upset, because this is modeling! Alright. Let's stick this back through the right way, and it did, went right through, look at that. Alright. Sorry for the delay. Alright. And through the hole, this is going to be the only part that's a little time consuming. Alright, and you are going to go through there sweet as pie and I have it the right way. Imagine that. How about that? Okay, it's not listening. I told her go through sweet as pie. Let's see how we're doing time-wise. Alright, I lied to you. went a little over. Okay. We're almost there. This is the only time consuming part. Okay. Go through there. There we go. Alright. Let's tighten that one up. Let's tighten it. That one. That one. And that one. Awesome! All right. Now, let's slip these ends off. We'll tighten that. And okay, we're almost there. Now the truck bed, the cab, fits nicely. Right up on this one also. Okay. Look at that. Okay. Let's hold my oh my switch. You know those switches on those uh, ESCs are a pain in the tusher. Okay. Super fast. Now all we got to do is slap the bed on. Oh, I know what fell off my little twirly. My little twirly whirly. I wonder what that noise was. Okay, we're chirping again. Okay. My pin. And you were going to go through here so smooth and fast. I got quick release on my um, dump truck so I can switch beds. I can put a flat bed on this, which I'll show you later. That is uh, pretty cool. You know, for hauling tractor or other things. All right, we are about 30 seconds away. Okay, two snips. Snip, snip. Got that bad. There's our new truck. Check out the front wheels. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Turn together. All right, let's not drive it off the edge. Dump bed. Look at that. There we go. We got a drivable dual cam. And look at Look at, there's no flop to that. That thing's amazing. These wheels, I mean, it's... All right. There's a depression in the table there, a dip. So, all right. So, I'm going to put up a video of this thing working now. But I wanted to show you guys on this uh, channel, my Facebook group, how I did this, this uh, uh, transition. All right. Thanks, guys.